Hey Ashley, here's a special request for you. You wanted us to take pictures of Florida, well Tampa. We're in Tampa right now. We just left um, Armando's mom and dad's friend's house. Um, and we're actually, hold on, let me show you. You go, it's like noontime and we're on our way back to Port Ritchie. We live like an hour north from here. Um, we're on our way to Port Ritchie. I'm going to show you around as I, um, and girl, it's like 80 degrees out here. Like I'm not even playing. <laughs> it is. It's so nice. And the houses are pretty. Well, this is Tampa. I'm in Tampa. And, um, you're about to see like the main roads like the businesses and stuff but we're like in the in the cuts like in the streets and stuff um what was I gonna say yeah it's 80 something degrees um look at the sky it's so pretty girl um oops. <laughs> sorry for the bumpiness I'm trying to get to the dome um No, my bad. We had to do some navigation stuff. But anyways, this is Tampa. I don't know what that is. A hospital. I think that's a hospital. Say hi, baby. This is Ashley. Hey. Beja Kamala Flood. Yeah, we, um, love traffic. My kids want to say hi. Um, Ash. Hi, Ashley. We love you and miss you. Hope to see you again. Oh, wait, no, that's not this Ashley. This is a different Ashley. Somebody you don't even know. They thought you were another Ashley. Say hi, then. But the grass is still green. The trees, the little palm trees, the little regular trees. It's real sunny and a lot of clouds. But the clouds are like puffy huh? white. We got the AC on, baby. Mm -hmm. Oh, this building that we always go by that looks like it has a pool sideways. Are we going to go by that building anytime soon? I would like to um to record that. It's probably on Dale Mabry or something or Hill Girl. That's Dale Mabry. That was probably just that was way down. Oh, okay. This is way home. We had a nice Christmas. We did. We woke up in someone else's house. We woke up at um, his friend's house, and um, the kids want to open their Christmas presents. They're anxious, and so it's like noon. So we finna do go. Um, girl, I ate so much. I'm probably getting like ten pounds. That's what it feels like, you know, when you just feel gross. That's kind of like what I feel is gross. I did because all that eating was at night. And it wasn't more that like I ate and stuff to my face. It was more that I started off with this um, guacamole 
refried beans, sour cream, and cheese dip with Tostitos. I, you know, they had a little tiny green plate. I think I went to it like three times. I mean, I shared. But still, that's a lot. <laughs> Compared to somebody who, you know, if you eat in the tortillas, chips, the bowl ones with that dip, that can really fill you up. And then I was drinking. So, you know, liquid like that. And then it was like uh, that coquito stuff, which is like eggnog. You know, it sits on your stomach and it's like milk, you know. And then with the cheese, I kind of felt like so bloated. Like I just needed to use the facilities and release. But I did not all night. All I did was pee. And I felt so gross. By the time we got the food, what time was it, baby? Like midnight? Let's just say we was eating our food. Like the food, food. It's a little bit before midnight. Cause I remember while I was still sitting there with my food, I'm like, hey, one more minute to to Christmas, and um, yeah, yeah, it was a little bit before midnight. So that's a lot, y'all. And you guys saw the video. I I will, if you haven't, I'm about to put it together about the food that was on my plate. But let me tell you, right after that video. That whole plate went in the garbage. And I felt so bad. You know, because it was good stuff. But, I mean, if you're so full, you can't force food down your belly. That's what I was doing. And I was just sitting there, and I felt like it just wanted to come up. And I even asked um, for some water. Right, baby? I was saying that I yeah. wanted to throw up. It was just, you know, your stomach gets used to a certain amount of portions or gets used to not eating at night. When you do eat, you just, it really, you really feel it, you know? Well, before, it's like, wow, my body really has done a difference. Because before, girl, I would have kept eating. <laughs> Actually, my favorite, oh, look at this. is pretty out of show you guys. I don't know what this is. It was a little like a shopping plaza. You see all the palm trees, how cute they look? I know, I'm all over the place. But, um. I don't know, it's just, it just, I realize I'm not the same Barbara. I am not the same Barbara that used to eat at nighttime. My favorite time to eat was at nighttime because I used to like how I felt going to bed full. Literally, that was my favorite thing to do was to eat. I'm just plugging in the charger, y'all. Okay. okay. My favorite time to eat was when it was time to go to bed. Because I used to like the feeling of feeling full. Being full, because being full when you are tired, being full it helps you sleep. Well, it was the thing for me, it helped me sleep. Hey, look, there's a chicken cheese right there, baby. Mm -hmm. We were looking for chicken cheese. We ended up taking it to the kids to a thing called Stop and Play. Which is kind of like a Chuck E. Cheese, but where we live in Port Richie. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, so that's, um, we're still in Tampa, right, baby? Yeah. Yeah. We are in Tampa. We are heading home to our destination, to where the kids can open up their presents. I'm going to stop recording soon. Um, I just wanted you to see you. I know you asked for some pictures, girl. But I can't just send you some pictures. I'm going to send you the real deal, real deal. <laughs> but this, the, um, the house is... What is this right here, baby? It still has a on it. No, what is that? Is that like no, a little shopping center? Yeah. I like it. Applebee's. It's a little plaza. Macaroni grill. Target. I love Target, y'all. I like Walmart more. If I could live at Walmart, and if there was only one store like Walmart, I'd be okay with that. <coughs> there you go. Some more in the palm trees. Oh, it's so beautiful. What? Sushi alive. But I have sushi. I want some sushi, but I want it to be cooked. 
or just veggies. But yeah, you guys, it's beautiful out here. We have all the windows up and we have the AC on. It's like 80 degrees, like what? Christmas, 80 degrees? Y'all, I'm not used to this weather. I'm from up north, you know? I'm used to it being a whole bunch of snow on the ground or it being so cold your ears hurt because they're numb. <laughs> and this is like... Summer. It really is like summer. Just Florida. <laughs> it's getting used to, you know, I miss my family and my friends. And you know, you do miss waking up Christmas morning and um, having you your hot cocoa or your coffee and sitting there off trying to get warm to open up your Christmas presents and looking outside and it's snowing you know I mean you miss all that but mm, I don't know if I had to pick this or that I've had enough snow all my life I've been around that kind of stuff for the holidays so I'm like you know shoot it's time for change it's beautiful out here it really is. Your girl is out. On the camera though. Right now. Oh. I'll make another video. For my food. For today. What I had this morning. Ooh, more cheese. More pop cheese. Um. Y'all, we always pass these cows. That sounds a little, um, Yeah. Oh, that's more down. Like half an hour from here. Oh, okay. But, bye, Ashley. Merry Christmas. And anybody who's watching this video, Merry Christmas. Today is Christmas. And, um, have a good day. Okay, y'all. We're heading home. We're so close to home. Yeah.